Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. Okay, this message is for all of my Leos, for all of my Leos, and this is the song I have. Let's get it on. Ah, let's get it on. <laughs> so somebody definitely is feeling you like that. And it's okay because you've been feeling yourself. Feeling yourself. I'm feeling my, feeling my. So you've definitely been in the energy of showing yourself love. And that's been radiating. That's been making you radiate. And this person is feeling you. And they want to be intimate with you. Just saw trees on the bottom of the deck. So there's definitely something that they want to grow with you. This person wants to grow with you. They see that you are very much so. Your aura is vibrating. Wars and battles. So this person has definitely been through some shit or you have been through shit. Take it how it resonates. In the past. That definitely was hard. It was some tough shit to get through. But you've learned lessons in this. You learn lessons in this, and you know you don't want to repeat the same mistakes. Leaving or travel. So you left all that shit behind you. All that shit that was no longer serving you, that was putting you like in bad health. You left that shit behind, beside you. It could definitely be involved, involving children or either childish behavior. All of that shit is gone. All right, all right, all right. Let's see what else is going on, Leos. You're realizing something has to be done by the book. There's not going to be no shortcuts in this situation. Or this person is. It's not going to be no shortcuts. Even though they they do want to get it on, they know they're going to have to go the distance, right? They know that they're going to have to show you. Okay, time is up. And they know it's time now. They know the time is now to go ahead and show that they can have that laid, leg up, show that they can work hard and show that they can get out of their help, head and actually grow. You know, actually grow, regenerate, learn, start from the bottom. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Like, start from the bottom and grow. Okay, bottom of the deck, chariot. Yeah, because there's a lot of things that they had to reconcile within themselves. They had to get that mental and emotional balance. And they had to go ahead and reevaluate a lot of situations. Then we have the page of swords. Yeah, because they had a lot of deceitful people around them. They were very manipulative, very childish people. And they were following, you know, you are your company. Hierophant. And they've been getting spiritual guidance. They've been getting signs of synchronicities. They've been learning. They've been growing. They've been studying to gain wisdom. Seven of Swords and the Queen of Pentacles. So, yeah, like I was saying, like, those people around them were very deceitful, very cunning, very much so trying to just make this person not do what the fuck is right. Homeboys, homegirls that just was in a lower vibrational energy. And even though this person knew what was right, they were falling into that trap. Queen of Cups. Yeah, but they're very intuitive. They're very improve, um, intuitive, and they want to improve on themselves. They want to improve. They're tired of being stuck and stagnant. They're tired of being in, in situations that no longer serve them. They're tired of being with people around them, just in their company, just in their presence, because they need some shit from them. They realize that it really, who's really, really here for me if I really, you know, at the end of the damn day, at the beginning of the day, any damn time of the day, as much as I be here for people, who's really here for fucking me, right? Then we have the Eight of Pentacles. So they're doing the groundwork. They're working on some shit. They're paying the close attention to detail about their surroundings and who the fuck they've involved themselves with and who the fuck, you know, there's seasons for everything. There's seasons for everything. So they, they're paying very close attention to who the fuck they need to release. The devil. Yeah, the devil. Because some shit has gotten them stuck. Some shit has gotten them held back. Some shit has, like, it's unpleasant. It's addiction. It's, it's people around them that ain't doing shit that's fucking worth it now. And they know what they gotta get from around that situation. They've been getting signs and synchronicities. Then we got the Nine of Cups in reverse. Yeah, because there's been some overindulgence in the situation. Like I was saying, if it's addiction, whatever it may be, if it's addiction, it don't got to be addiction to drugs. It can be addiction to anything that no longer serves you, right? But it could be addiction to drugs as well, right? But they, they're making some poor lifestyle choices. They're overindulging in certain situations. And a lot, right? And, and, and being dissatisfied with themselves and, you know, and not worrying about what the fuck really matters. 
trying to get money to always, you know, always needing some shit. Acting very needy because they need this, whatever they're addicted to. They need funds for it. So they, they worrying about their money to get what the fuck they need, but they don't need to, they, what they don't realize that they, that they have everything they already need. The magician. But they're waking up to this shit now. They waking up to the shit that they don't need anything but what they already have to go ahead and break through from this shit. To get these devils the fuck off of you. You just gotta concentrate and evaluate <laughs> what the fuck is going on and straighten out, you know, and, and regulate. Okay. And regulate. Thank you, Spirit Guys. Thank you, Angels. Ancestors. Thank you, Father. Father God. Ace of Cups. Yeah, because you want this new situation. You you want to get your emotional health. You want to get your 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 mental health. You want to get your your inner self love correct. You want to get that all in alignment for the motherfucking assignment. This person, Leo's, you. This person, take a high resonate. Four of cups. Yeah, because this person has been very discontent. They've been very bored. They've been very stuck. They've been very much such so in their head, very self absorbed, very much so. Um, just not going anywhere, right? Because they need to to get out of their head. They need to move on situations. They need to actually see what the fuck is really for them and, and, and clear their surroundings and just silence their surroundings so they can really hear that small voice and what the fuck is telling them to do. And the, the voice is telling them that they need balance. They need to take accountability for what they've done and they need balance and they need to honor certain situations and move away from shit that no longer serves them, right? Definitely feel like there was some addiction here. <clears throat> Nine of Swords. Yeah, and there's been a lot of suffering. This person, like, it's, it's been a lot of suffering around this. When, like, as far as our family members worrying about them, the people that really fucking care, right? The people that they're not seeing, but they're opening up their eyes to see, and now they really fucking care. It's, it's been a lot of shit that's been overwhelming. But it, a lot of shit that has been delayed, it will gain progress once this person realizes, or they, they already are realizing they're opening up to the situation, but once this person actually put work in to heal these wounds, basically. What is this? The Hermit in Reverse. So, yeah, this person's been very, very lonely, and they've been keeping shit to themselves. They feeling like they can't open up um, because, you know, it's always judgment. And you should not, you know, people always are quick to judge somebody. But, like, that's why people don't open up to people because people quick to judge. And this, that's exactly how this person feels. They just want to keep some shit to themselves, whether that be they need help, whether that be need the, uh, whether that be they can't properly communicate or they can't, they need uh, treatment or whatever. They can't, you know, Ace of, Ace of Wands and um, Ten of Cups. Yeah, because this person is very artistic, they're very creative, and they have the will and determination. And and they they have the power to expand just that potential to become a reality, right? To lead to that satisfaction, to lead to the completion, to lead to that good fortune, to to lead to that harmonious lifestyle. They have what it takes. All right, all right, all right. Let me see. Let's get some last advice with my angels and ancestors. Oracle deck. No, I'm going to use a monology. And then whenever I said that, it was like, no, not even that. The star seed. Okay. So there's something in in the star seed oracle that the last of us. Okay. Yeah, and that was that fell in reverse. And it's karmic relationships. Thank you, spirit guys. Thank you, Holy Father. Thank you, ancestors, for confirmation. So, yeah, com these karmic um, relationships that are not leaving any balance that are on different, you know, different universes, different planets, and they just can't seem to get in alignment, that they're just lessons, that was in reverse. There's, they're ending these karmic relationships for a new beginning. Yes, yes. All right, all right, all right. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe for all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals. Head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. As always, peace, love, and namaste.